Good morning, happy Saturday. Um, today I am about to embark on a road trip. I am going somewhere, well, completely different part of the country to go and pick up a new addition to the family and I'm very excited. Uh, I have this to collect said things in. Um, but first stop uh, is basically, I've got to go to the local town, to the bank no, and get some cash out. Routes, no major problems on the motorway network or Oh, that's like good. That. Apparently no major problems on the motorway network. Eaten. Must have known. I'm just about to leave. Anyway, so first stop. Alrighty, that's me being to the shop. Um, it just happens to have a little uh, uh, auto teller. Auto teller? I don't even know what you call them now. Cash dispenser, cash bank thing. Anyway, got my cash. You can tell I'm so excited this morning. Um, got my cash, got little snacks for the trip. Where's the snacks? There'll be the snacks uh, for the trip. It's only two hours away, but still. <laughs> I can't go anywhere without food. So, cash, snacks. Now I just need to do uh, program twat nav, and that's me good to go. There we go, sat nav is on. Uh, and I should get there in just over two hours. Let's get the tunes on and get cracking. So I got to my destination, okay. I got there within two hours, so it didn't take me too long. And I have, I have the things in the box that I went to pick up. I'll show you. Okay, that's me back home now. God, that's a long ass way. Anyways, here we go. Uh, we're gonna release the new family members. Oh, I'm so excited. At least they've come out of the coop. Um, this lot are interested. Come on, babies, come and say hello. I, don't, I think they're scared of me, actually. Who's that? Any of your hoofs? I'm going to just keep going back inside. Ah, I know what I'm going to do. Well, that was easier than I thought. Just shut the new ducks in the coop. And uh, got the old ones back in. Oh look, they're saying hello. Oh hello. Yes, I told you I had some handsome men for you. Oh, oh. oh don't you want make a gorgeous group? Tiny bit of a standoff at the minute. The new ones in the coop, the old ones in the pen going, um, why, why are we being imprisoned right now? Oh, there we go. Shy one. Where's the shy one not coming out? Maybe because I'm here. I think she might be scared of me. Uh, they'll get used to me. Come on, little shy one. Over there, doesn't look very happy. 
The two boys might be stolen away from her. That won't happen, madam. They both love you. You know that. Uh oh, yeah, she's down the mill. Yeah, it's definitely me. The third one's not very keen on. I took a few steps back and she's come out, so I'll just gently see if I can get closer and closer and hopefully not scare her away. I'll have to get used to her pen. Oh, I'm home. It's not a pen, because she won't be in there. She'll be in the coop and then she'll be out on the back. Yep, she's definitely keeping her eye on me. No, not keen. Never mind, you'll grow to love me, Babs. Promise. So there you have it. A four hour, 200 mile round trip just to get myself three Khaki Campbell ducks. Um, what I think I'll do is I think I'm going to leave them in the, um, I'll leave them in the pen anyway with the other ducks and then obviously in the coop overnight, but I'll leave them in the pen for the rest of the day for them just to get acquainted with themselves. Um, I think one of my dogs is trying to escape the garden. Bear with me one second. So the dogs can clearly smell the newbies. They're like that. <gasps> babies. I can smell babies. Where are they? The dogs love babies. It's ridiculous. Anyways, thankfully they're in the pen so that when the, the dogs see them for the first time, they'll be behind the pen and the dogs aren't gonna think there's some sort of food. Let's see how that works out later when we take them out for a walk. Um, but anyways, yeah, so I'm gonna be leaving them all to get acquainted in the pen and the coop overnight and then I might leave them in for another day. It just depends. I'll see what they're like in the morning. I'll see if they've calmed down from their journey. Um, and if they seem like they're not going to be too flighty, then I'll let them out onto the back. Um, I actually, I don't think these ducks have seen water, as in swam in it, which to me is really, really sad because ducks belong on the water. You know what I mean? So, yeah, I went to pick them up from the, the person that sold them to them. They're actually a sort of unofficial rescue centre, so I think these babies have been rescued. There was quite a lot of them, but there was only three left. Um, the others have been accounted for. Dogs, what are you doing? Crazy asses. Um, so, uh, yeah, so I only got three, um, but I didn't realise they were kind of an unofficial rescue centre and they've got loads of chickens and they rescue guinea pigs and rabbits as well. So I don't know if, um, yeah, they've ever seen water, if they've ever been on the water, but I can't wait to see them go on the back for the first time in the morning because they, that, you know, that's where they belong. They, they just instinctively know what to do when they hit the water. So I am excited, but I'm really sorry about this. These crazy asses, you crazy asses. Um, yeah, so we'll see. We'll see how it goes, but that's it for today. For me anyway, I'm about to sit down with a coffee because I'm, I'm a wee bit tired. Have a coffee, then get the dogs out for a walk, and then get back, get dinner made, and then settle down for a nice chilled out Saturday night, like always with some red wine. Yes, please, thank you very much. So anyway, hope your Saturday has been as wonderful as mine, and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you for watching. Bye.